Core stability is a myth. Now, it's often believed that having a weak or dysfunctional trunk or core leads to lower back pain or back pain in general. However, it's been shown that actual trunk strength has no relation to back pain. Further, the ability for the trunk to stabilize the spine only takes around 2% of maximum voluntary contraction when walking or standing, meaning it takes 2% of the maximum force it can generate to stabilize the spine. Now, you simply add a 32 kilo weight to the torso and it only bumps it up to 3%. So it begs the question, why are we isolating the core and loading it with such heavy loads when it's not really needed? Now, that's not to say core training is not uh, is not important, but it should be trained in an integrated manner where we're trying to create whole body tension through the trunk in order so we can transfer force from the ground through the legs and through the torso, through the arms, through things like throws, offset carries, and other rotations.